Oh my hair, it's okay. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. And today I'm gonna be making some stuffed peppers. But I'm watching from a YouTube video. So it's not my recipe. I got it from Cooking with Tammy. And I didn't get all the ingredients she had because we couldn't find some of this stuff. But I got most of them. And then I think I'm gonna do mine like in layers. So like meat, cheese, meat, cheese, meat, you know, cheese. If that makes sense. But yeah, so <laughs> I got my friends in the background. So if y'all hear talking or hey, hey, yeah, see me smiling, I'm smiling at <laughs> But my computer acts slow. Well. <laughs> <Not that many. laughs> no. <laughs> okay, there we go. So my ingredients that I got today are vegetable oil. I got it from Walmart. Most of my stuff I got was Walmart brand because you know baddie on the budget. <laughs> but <Period. laughs> I got whole garlic cloves. Y'all not gonna be able to see it because my brightness. Do the little, huh? You know, you want your hand like that? Oh. No, this ring light just overpowering. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> What is that? Adab Adab Adabo? Adabo? I got some Adabo. Adabo. I don't know. Okay, look like it's gonna focus. I'll put a picture if y'all that pressed. Um, I got some black pepper, Creole seasoning. I got tomato sauce. We got two of those. Some cheap salt. It was only 54 cents. I got some onion powder, paprika. Rustic basil, it's like basil, basil spread. Um, chili powder, one white onion. She recommended a white, I mean, she recommended a yellow onion and a green onion, but they didn't have green onions. I got rice, light brown sugar, and I, did I show them the ground beef already? And the ground beef. So, I'm about to pull up her video. We gonna watch how she cook it because I don't know how to cook. I don't be cooking for real, so. This is an experiment. Oh, I forgot to show you the main ingredients. The freaking bell peppers. <laughs> the bell peppers is what I got also. Um, <laughs> um, I bought these cutting boards from the dollar store because I don't want to cut on our counters. So, it's called a chopping mat, that's what it's called. I'm gonna use that, here's another pick and tip things. What you call them, tax? Okay, so here's my cutting board. First, I'm gonna wash off our peppers and then I'm gonna cut the tops off. Oh, that worked. Watch her cook and then I'm gonna do my own thing or whatever. So the first thing I'm gonna do is cut the tops of the onions off because, I mean not the onions, the top of the peppers off because we don't need them and yeah. Have y'all ever had stuff, stuffed peppers? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Have y'all had stuffed peppers? Yes, I have. No, I have not. It's like, what should I talk about in my cooking vlog while I'm like, not doing nothing? What? Yeah. Y'all don't know? No. I'm talking about Yeah. Well, I'ma talk about school and life. Okay. So, life's good. Wait, what is it? <laughs> the FNF? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyway, we'll life's good, but still good. Yeah. Anyway, but yeah. Mm-hmm. School and life been going good or whatever. Um, well, we didn't start school yet. Only thing I'm stressed about is charisma because I'm not even gonna talk about that because we might have the ops watching. <laughs> it's like, no. But that's the only thing stressing me out. Come on, girl. Oh, wait, we eat it from the bottom of these? 
Okay, so she cut the bottom. I thought they just cut the whole top off. So, whatever. I'm just going to do what I see her do. She cut the bottom and the top off. So, just. I don't know why she did that. I don't want to cut too much of it off because that's the best part of the whole look thing. So then, you gotta, I'm gonna have to cut more. Okay, you're not supposed to see the white. Huh? You're not supposed to see the white. Oh, okay. There you go, yeah. And then you're gonna cut the inside out. So I'm gonna just, like this. Dang. It's not hard to come out the middle. Like that, I return that, but you leave the food wraps. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. 
depending on if you text me about it. Yeah. Everybody's gonna let me give you the one. Mm -hmm. And you got, I say, I know my food missing within two hours, so you got two hours for there. Going. So, I'm peeling off like the little white stuff inside of this pepper because, like, not too much. Because I don't know. So, throw your access away. And I think I'm gonna rinse the peppers off one more time because it's like hella seeds on here. So, I'm about to do that. I'm gonna stick them over here first. Rinse this off. These people gonna have to keep the bottom. Yeah, I didn't know it was cutting the bottom off. But maybe, I don't think everybody does that. Some people leave the bottom on. Yeah. So, that's how I had mine, the bottom was on. So, we ain't know. Okay, so I got my peppers cut. I'm gonna sit these to the side and then I'm gonna get the ones that we chopped the heads off of. And basically, I don't know what she's saying, but she cutting it like vertically. So, and obviously you don't want the part that's white. So I think I'm gonna just, nah, it's gonna be too much. I'm not gonna be able to dice these. Okay, what else should I say? Hmm. Let's see what I should talk about. Um, okay, top three artists. Top three artists right now? Yep. Okay, number one is Rod Wave. Mm -hmm. two, them hard, them two is Dirk. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Three is, okay, let's see who I listen to. I really only listen to Dirk and Rod Wave. But if I had to, oh, no cap. Yeah, top three. He a body for sure. No I love him. That you know he got a girlfriend. I didn't know that. I was hurt as fuck. <laughs> he just posted that shit like two days ago. Yeah. I was gonna hurt myself, <laughs> but I'm happy you're happy. <laughs> but I'm hurt at the same time. But yeah, top three artists for sure. Rod Wave just did his thing on that album, so y'all need to go watch it and y'all need to go watch it and um. Let me know what you think about it. People ask for me to react to that because I used to do reactions on my thing. Oh yeah, get who wants smoke reaction to 100K. We have like 92K. Get it to 100K and okay. then I'll do a shout out or something. I don't know. <laughs> but I want to start collabing with people too. I feel like collabing with people bring more exposure. But I don't know nobody. I only know like two people on social media who are like no, but they don't live nowhere over here. So, I don't know. Ooh, I cut my nail. But yeah, so basically, you're just gonna keep doing this. And I'm gonna come smaller than that. I'm just trying to wait and see how much we gonna have. Cause it's gonna be a lot in this uh, meat. It's like watching Rachel Ray. I'm dead as fuck. <laughs> My granny watcher. I like watching the flip shows. I like watching house shows. Like when they flip houses and all of that. I used to love watching that. I, I love it. Mm -hmm. all yeah, of it. I love it. I used to watch American Home. What is it? American Makeover? Extreme Makeover Home Edition. That's what it's called. You used to watch that? Yeah, I seen one where they made one in um, Cleveland, mm -hmm. and it was like right around the corner from where I used to live. Really? Like, it was. It's so fucking beautiful. Like it goes down like to maybe like the next street, the whole house. And then they rent be paid on there. I think too. They yes. like something. Something is fully paid off. The yes. whole rent, like. Forever. Yeah. Yeah, something like that. Like. I don't know. I don't know if it's forever. It's Maybe they do that for the video. Everything nice. And they, they fill up the everything is blue. Like refrigerator. They literally. Like, oh yeah, and they do shit for school. They do a lot of stuff. I think you apply for something. And they don't do it no more. Yeah. But this was like back like. And then. But while they doing that, they send you to Disney World too with your yes. whole family. Everything yes. paid for. Why? I used to be like, jealous. Like, like damn, I wish my house was fucked up. Nah. They. For real, I used to wish my house was fucked up. My mama had a sob story because can y'all come here? <laughs> Shit. I'm like Disney World for free. Right. I don't know that. I don't know why I was worried I'm about it, it being free. Like I was gonna pay for some shit anyway. <laughs> but yeah. Okay. I don't know about it. Y'all been to Disneyland? No. I haven't been to Disney anything. 
talking about Disney World. Right? No, Disney went. This, yeah. The one in Florida is Disney World. Either or. I That's the biggest one. I ain't been to Disneyland. They said Disney World has. It's actually like its own world. People have houses inside of Disneyland. It's streets called Disneyland. They got their own zip code. They got their own everything. It's literally like the land. Like they bought out half of the fucking state or whatever and made it theirs. But that's why they get in sued because somebody said y'all can't do that no more. Because they literally got streets after them. Like they got a phone line, houses, schools, everything. What? Yes. Disney High School? What's going on? They, they, got, like, they, got, they got a whole little, it's like a little coat. Really? A little, little coat? Oh, God. That's like a little coat. I don't know. They probably dressing like the show. Man. <laughs> literally, it's a whole town. Because it's like, it's so big. It's eight continents inside of Disneyland. Like, that's how they shit, because they go, I mean, Disney World, it's a different world. So, I don't know which worlds they have in there, but it's eight different continents or some shit like that. I'm like, I did not know it was that fucking big, though. Like, that's crazy. I don't know. something new every Yeah. Okay, I'm going to talk about my dream vacation. Do y'all have somewhere y'all want to go for y'all dream vacation? Yeah. Where? Um, Bora Bora. Bora Bora? Mm -hmm. What about you? Or Dubai. Okay. I was gonna go to Dubai for my twenty first, but that eighteen hour plane ride really not not it at all. Ooh, <laughs> I think my future one, like my top one, I would want to go to. Um, I really don't know. Like, nothing really pulls my eye for me to want to go besides Bora Bora, and it that really don't even. I mean Dubai, and that barely pulls my eye. Like, it's just somewhere to go. But I don't really, like, I haven't explored anywhere to see my dream vacation. Mm -hmm. But I do want to go to Jamaica. I'm going for my birthday. Yeah, I want to go to Jamaica. I want to go to Paris, too, but that's not, like, my dream vacation. I just want to go to mm -hmm. yeah. I can't kill with these nails if y'all okay. can Oh, what's your favorite movie? My favorite movie? Mm -hmm. And why? Um, I don't think I have a favorite movie. I really watch TV. I'm going to just... Tell y'all my favorite TV show. Vampire Diaries. Whoa. Top 10. They're taking, so they taking it off Netflix September 2nd. You're lying. Yes, and the original's already off of there. It's only one season on there. Huh? I'm like, why would y'all do that? Bro, Vampire Diaries been trending on you I mean on Netflix for like a year straight. It was always in the trend. I'm like, why are, the fuck are y'all taking it off? Yeah. But you know, the people who made the, the Vampire Diaries, they probably like, damn, like, they getting all these views on my show on Netflix. I'm barely getting paid. I'm paying them to put it on there. Mm -hmm. They probably took that shit off so people could buy it. Because that's how they make money from all of that. So, yeah. I'm going to assume that's what they did. Just like with the Polar Express and stuff, like, they own there now in the summer. But as soon as the winter comes, they pull their movie off of there so people could buy it from, like, Prime and stuff like that. So, that's why that works. It don't be Netflix. It be the people. They so be they be killing them on social media. Mm -hmm. They be killing them. Okay, so now that all of this is chopped, I'ma cut it some more because it's like still some big pieces in here. So I'ma do this without breaking my finger or cutting my finger off. That's how we're gonna do this. Another question. I should have did a QA. Like, but I didn't even know I was gonna cook tonight. I woke up thinking about some peppers with my fat ass. Okay, I have a question. <laughs> yeah. I just seen this one on uh, Instagram. So it said uh it's a a lion, a hippo, an alligator, and a bear. Mm -hmm. You have what is, I think it said two two minutes. I don't know, two minutes to get away or something. Mm -hmm. Which one would you pick to get away from? What's the, yeah, what's the, yeah. Okay, it's Lion, a, hippo. Mm -hmm. A bear and an alligator. You have two minutes okay. to get away from it. Which one would you pick to get away from? So I would for sure get away from a hippo because. You're going to get away from a hippo? Yeah. Do y'all know how dangerous hippos are? Are they worse than? Yeah, but no, like which one would you be able to get away from? Like, oh. I don't know because them bitches be jumping up the water. Like which one would you like take your chance with? I'm gonna say alligator. I'm gonna say alligator too because you crawling and shit. <laughs> I'm really running. Yeah. I'm gonna say alligator too. <laughs> that I really the hardest. They, they, they gotta put effort into moving their body. Yeah, so like, it ain't gonna take. Yeah, I'm about to go. I'm already gonna. Anybody need to climb? They can't climb. The first one I took right. was the tiger. I hope. I took I hope that away. 
You said what? I took away the tiger first. Yeah. If a tiger head on with me, I'm just gonna close my eyes. <laughs> Look, Lord, forgive me for my, my sins. Oh, okay. just close my motherfucking eyes. It's my time. I thought about the bear, but some of them they can get kind of fast. Yeah. And the motherfuckers is big. Okay, I think this is cool enough. Y'all want y'all like the inside to be crunchy or like softer? Cause if they crunchy, I can leave them big like this. But if y'all want them soft, I could cut them some more. But I kind of like my stuff crunchy. You want a small one? Okay. <laughs> okay, so I like my insides to be like, cause it's soft with the meat and then crunchy with this. So I'm gonna leave it crunchy. So what she did was she put all of this into a bowl. So I'm gonna just pick the mat up and pour it in the bowl. Not too much though. Okay, so yeah, this one way too big. Just put them in a bowl after you cut them and then I don't know the next step yet. So we're getting our skillet. I am going to use this because I got six. Okay, I don't know where my camera cut off at, but I was basically saying she put hers inside of a bowl. I'm gonna put mine in here. I should have got a smaller one because it's like room on the outside, but it'll be okay. So we're gonna put these in here and then I think we're gonna set them to the side. Okay. Next, she got her oil and her thing. So I think we're about to cook the meat. I already let my meat defrost, so defrost, defrost. I already did that. So I'm about to go and cook the meat. Actually, we're not about to cook the meat. We gotta cook this, and she cut onions. So let me do that. I hate onions with a freaking passion. But you know what? My friends like them, so I said I'll add a little hint in them. <laughs> or in there, I mean. So honestly, I don't know how to work with onions. Now I gotta peel this paper off. No, that's what I heard. Cut it like oh, so it can so it won't cry, yeah. Like, cut it, don't look, yeah. Which one did it, yeah, like that? Cut that off, cut that off. I thought they said don't cut that off. I heard they say do cut that off. Oh, okay, I do cut that off, yeah. Do it still bleed though? Like, do it cry? I don't, damn. Hold on, the last couple times I didn't cut it back, just one size. Just start with one oh. Should I not cut this out off too? Was it this house? <laughs> Erica, bro, she's tweaking. Was it this house? <laughs> because I can smell it. You fucking I mean, I don't know. Shit. <laughs> you can cut it off. Cut it off, then, shit. I don't smell it, though. Mine's not crying. Yeah, mine didn't either. Cut it off? <laughs> I don't know. She said, I don't know. Look, <laughs> <laughs> like, she only heard half of the story. I'm about to cry. <laughs> Y'all feel like a grown woman, so I just moved into my apartment and I gotta peel this paper off, right? Mm -hmm. I just moved into my apartment. We had some difficulties. I'm not gonna tell y'all because it's just a no. But all I'm gonna say is do not live at University Hills in Toledo because you will regret your life. <laughs> like, real bad. So I would say don't even do it. Don't even look this way. As soon as our little one year up, we gone. Ooh. I should put on goggles. <laughs> Ooh. Y'all, I'm about to cry. Yeah. Let's talk about something else. What's the topic? Yeah, I'm shit about that. Have you seen that shit about uh, Christian? Mm-hmm. What you think about that? And I think no. that she needs to learn her worth and leave him alone. Literally. They pulled her whole hair out. I didn't even see that. I didn't want to look at it. I'm tired of seeing them. I'm tired of seeing them. It's like, I feel like social media know what they doing too. Because the more y'all going to post it, the more they going to keep, you know, doing what the fuck they doing. The toxic shit. Should I cut it? Or this way? But yeah, I feel like she needs to learn her worth. I'm scared this shit gonna blow my eye. Well, I'm scared it's in the mirror. It's like a forbidden apple or some shit. 
Okay, so I don't like onions like that, so we only gonna do this. Your eyes burn? Palms are on one of Yeah, so, ooh. Y'all see I'm splitting? You got your all? It's in this side. It's not in there, but it's in there. Okay. Set it to the side, chop these up in little bitty, like how we did the um, peppers. Ooh, no. Mm -mm. garlic too so let me do that and then I'll be back okay so I got my minced garlic and I'ma just put it in there too she put all her stuff in different bowls but I think she just did that for the aesthetic of the video and I'm not doing all that so yeah they are going in the same bowl and I already washed these so don't come for me but I'ma use so I'm gonna use the spoon and then I got olive oil or vegetable oil for the um pot because we're gonna have to pour it in the pot so hold on I need to hear her first we're using this pan and we're gonna add some vegetable oil but I don't know because vegetable oil be popping mm. maybe I should have got I don't know. She didn't say what type of oil, so we just got vegetable oil. So I'm gonna just pour a little in there and make the pan, I don't know, spread it across the pan or whatever. And then she said we wanna wait until it's hot, so I'm gonna put our stove on eight and let this get hot. But in the meantime, I'm about to open up the meat because we're gonna be putting this in there too. Did I get the wrong meat? I don't think so. Don't you use these for like tacos and stuff? Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm gonna use the whole thing. Okay, so yeah, we just letting the pan get hot. That's what's taking so long. So I'm gonna start the mix because I feel like my pan is hot now. So, like I said, she had hers in different bowls. I'm just gonna pour everything that I just mixed up in here. And then I'm gonna stir it with my spatula. And then she said we wanted to let this cook until everything got soft and until you could smell the garlic. But I only had the little whole garlic clove. She actually had minced garlic and a regular garlic. So I don't know if you're gonna be able to smell mine, but 
we gonna see it. I hope I poured enough oil. I think I did. I'm excited, I'm so hungry. I feel like this is gonna be so good. So let me know if I should start a cooking channel or whatever. And we're gonna be cooking new stuff like every week. Cause I told Erica, I think I wanna do like a Sunday dinner every week, yeah. like our friends and cook. Once I get that EBT card, because look, I'm a broke college student. <laughs> Once I get that EBT card, it's oh, I'm buying everything. Spices I never heard of. <laughs> Cause I definitely wanna do, I wanna try to make some egg rolls, like some spring rolls. I wanna do that. I want some cheese sticks. I wanna try uh, them, uh, what's them corn dog things? Them Korean corn dogs? Oh yeah. Like a corn dog in there, but it's like the cheese and shit. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. And I want to do, I should, y'all, I should do potatoes on the side. But actually, I just thought about it. I'm going to turn this eye down and I'm going to let this sit and marinate for a minute. But while this is doing that, I got some rice I got to boil because we're going to put rice inside of our um, peppers mixed in with that. And I know she's going to pour it in there and mine not going to be ready. So I'm about to do that now. I forgot about this. All right. I'm gonna turn this eye down because this junk cooking quick. So I got my eye on two right now and I'm gonna let it sit for like 10 minutes because I'm gonna still stir it though, but I gotta cook my rice. Okay, so I'm about to put some water in here and let that soak. Okay, so let your water come to a boil and then you put the rice in and then you let the rice cook for 10 minutes. So I'm gonna just stir this again because um, it's sizzling. It do smell really good though. I feel like all I can smell is the onions. And since I cut them big, I'm gonna let them sit some more so they can get more soft because I don't want them too crunchy. Like if they big, they could be a little crunchy, but if they little, they could be a lot crunchy, but these are kind of big, so. And now I'm gonna like, spread it out so a lot of them are touching the bottom I gotta show my Instagram you know content creator in the making let me show them these look real pale right now <laughs> but it's okay because I ain't put no season on them yet but I'm gonna give y'all a sneak peek and then I'm gonna show y'all how the final product don't look it's gonna be so good so what else should I talk about? Y'all, I'm gonna, I don't know what to talk about. So I'm gonna be looking up some stuff later in later videos. Because I don't know. There's really nothing else to talk about. Phoebe is bad. Oh. You're cooking show, gang, gang. Day Day's on the phone. Day Day, I'm cooking some stuffed peppers. Do you think they're gonna be good? Well, you know what's really crazy. It was a yes or no, but what? Did you? What you cook? Okay, y'all. It's like, it's not, I don't know. Anyways, so, um, I don't know why I separated this yet, but I let it sit for a minute and my water still has to come to a boil. <laughs> I'm going to add a dash of salt in the food. She said don't add too much. So I'm only gonna add, I'm gonna show y'all what I'm gonna add. I think I'm gonna add this much. Let's see the focus. Yeah, maybe a little more. And I'm gonna just sprinkle, sprinkle, sprinkle. Low key, this might be too much. Yeah, that's too much. I'm not adding all that. The black pepper. I like black pepper. I feel like it brings the mm out in the food. After we do that, we're gonna give it another stir. I hope it don't taste like I'm being stingy with the damn seasoning because I barely put any in there. <laughs> So after you mix all that in, make a circle in the middle of your pot. So put all the vegetables like on the outside or the peppers, I mean, put them all on the outside and make a circle like that. I hope y'all can see my screen. I mean, my thing. 
Yeah. So anyways, after we do that, we're gonna get our meat, and I showed y'all the meat I got. You can get the, the pound of meat, like the one that come in the actual flat package. But I got this one, and I'm just gonna squeeze it out, and I'm gonna squeeze it in the middle. This feels so freaking weird. Okay. And you wanna make sure your meat is cooked because we do not wanna have that new disease that's out. What is it called? E. coli. Uh, that's what uh uh, we don't <laughs> want that. So make sure your meat is really freaking cooked because that's just nasty if it's not. So. So yeah, um, I'm about to cook the meat until it turned brown or whatever. So I'm gonna cut my eye back up because my stupid self keep cutting it down, forgetting I cut it down. But um, hmm. I think she just let hers marinate. I'm gonna cut it up all the way and then I'm gonna just smush it out though. And our water has come to a boil. It's not like a complete boil, it's like half and half. I probably let it go for two more minutes and then put my rice in there. And we put in some of the rice in our peppers and then we eat in some on the side because I forgot to get a side. I didn't know, I thought like a whole pepper was like a meal. So I didn't know if you get sides for it or not, but we did it. What time is it so I could time this? 9.41. 9.41, so at 9.51, we'll be taking this out for the water. Really? Mm. Mm. Bad rice mat, I ain't gonna lie. That's all I ever ate. Okay, I, what, what rice you had? The mini rice? This is the mini rice. But I mean, I never had in the bag, like, Oh, it don't come in bags with that one? Mm -hmm. Oh. So yeah, just keep stirring. And then, you're gonna keep doing this until your meat get brown. This meat's stubborn, it don't wanna rip. I'm kinda messing my pot up because she left her peppers on the outside, but I want this meat to be well done, so. Mine not stay on the outside. So some of them are drenched in here. It's like eleven o'clock. That's so crazy. And can you do me a favor and take the butter out of the fridge, please? It's right on that top row. And the cheese. Wait, this one we just got, or Kobe Jack. Kobe Jack. Yeah. Thank you, ma'am. So, with me, I put butter inside of my rice. Like after it come out and everything. I don't know if y'all see me crooked, but my tripod is like messed up. But um yeah, I put my butter inside the rice after it's done. So once I pour that in the bowl, I'm gonna um put like half of the butter in there. Not half, but close to it. And then this meat is almost brown. Do it? Yes. <laughs> she said it smells good, y'all. <laughs> I'm geek. I'm geek the geek the. I haven't heard that song in so long. So anyway, campus is about to get back going, so I'm excited. I'm a party girl. I love to party. Me and Erica, y'all, me and Erica didn't get turned together since homecoming last year. That was October. Hey. Mm -hmm. A year. Yeah. 
And we were so drunk. On, oh my God, y'all don't even know the half of that story. Mm -hmm. I don't even know how, Never mind. <laughs> Anyways, we were so drunk that night. Like, we had a parking lot party after the party was over and the security was putting us out saying we have to go home. And he literally got in our car because we had rolled all the windows down in the car. And then we played the music. We turned the music all the way up. We got people on top of the car, people in the front of the car. We out the doors. Then this girl had pulled up. What'd she say? Do you know what I'm talking about? Yeah, I remember buying what she I think she was like, it's a party. Where the part was a party where we was at. Well, it was already over by the time she got there. So I basically like went up to her car, opened her door, and told her to get out. And they started twerking with us. It was just so much going on. But it was so fun. We were so drunk. And we got drunk early because when we first got in there, they was playing like Bryson Tiller. I was twerking to Bryson Tiller, <laughs> Tiller bro. And you know, because all his shit is slow. Like, bitch, what did you do? Sit down. We had a whole outfit change. People, uh, Angel had went back to home, brought us back clothes. We had a whole outfit change. Motherfucking shoe change, I mean. Because I don't think I changed my clothes. I think I just changed. Oh, yeah, I had put some shorts on because I don't like this dress. But it was like, um,. It was real glittery and it was like, I think we overdressed. They said we look the best in there. Hopefully they know how to step this time. Cause the way the theme was, you would think, okay, step how you step at home coming to high school. That's what we did. Mm -hmm. So I had on like this glittery ass dress. My boobs was out. And then Erica had on this uh, pink uh, two piece, like a skirt and then a crop top with um, her sides out. It was real cute and it was silky. Montana had on uh, leather pants and a white shirt and then Angel had on like a white shirt and I can't remember I think she had a leather pants too but when we got there everybody else had on shit like this so we was looking so stupid like are we overdressed like and then we was tiptoeing we had no heels you know I had on my six inch heels like Ooh. it was just so much and we thought we was overdressed but everybody was saying we was cute but mind you that party started at nine we started drinking like at seven because we was so drunk when we got there I had a mixed drink the MXDs I had that. Erica had a whole bottle of Ciroc to herself. Ooh, we had Crown Apple. Then we was tailgating the uh, morning. So we had the shit there. I think I had like Hennessy. And then I had. Uh, oh, the clear water. Ice water. Bro, the clear water? We had hella it's clear water. Yeah, I want some water too. It's clear water. Me and Erica kept going back in the cups. I don't even know how they how they didn't tell us we had enough. But yeah. and me and her had that one because they were selling it there. And Erica was in line. She was like, I'm paying for everybody. I'm like, no, nah, she just paying for us. Like she was so drunk. <laughs> yeah. I'm like, uh-uh, girl. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna keep stirring our meat because it's coming to a brown. So now I'm just mixing my meat and mixing the peppers. It looks real bland right now because um, I didn't put no seasoning in there yet. So it's probably loud because my fans. So I'm just gonna take my um, I'm gonna take my rice out, drain it, then pour the rice back in a pot and put my stick of butter in there. So I cut my stove down to two, so this um, could slowly cook while I get the rice prepared. So basically with the rice, you wanna be careful with this cause these rice bags ain't no joke when they hot at all. But you pick the rice up and I'ma cut my bag just so, oh wait, I'ma have to put the butter in there now because the bottom of this is like burning. Butter in the pot. And it can really just melt how it is. It, damn, it doesn't matter. Because you're about to mix your rice up in there anyways. So I'm gonna cut the bags open like I said. And just cut them all the way off and just save more time. And then you just literally just tip them. And you wanna hurry up and stir with them down there. Oh, this shit is hot. You want to hurry up and stir with it down there because, like I said, the pan is hot and it's getting stuck to the bottom. Mm -hmm. You said what? Mm 
So I'm gonna just move this in the back because I don't want my rice to burn. But basically you just stir the butter and you let the butter melt. That gives it, I don't know. That's like a whole different type of time. It's good. I low-key probably need to put a little more butter. But we gonna see. All I used to eat as a kid was really like rice and sugar. It's so freaking good. Do y'all put sugar on y'all rice? Yeah, I put sugar. Well, I think it depends. It is so freaking good. I want to make breakfast one day too. I'm about to be cooking everything. Okay. So now we're going to start adding the seasonings. I got salt, black pepper, adobo, onion powder. I don't care if I'm not pronouncing it right. Creole, Creole, paprika, chili powder, and then the basil. I got it. <laughs> I thought I ate, but the basil. <laughs> so we are gonna just do a little hint of, I'm gonna just move this cause I'm not gonna need it right now. We're gonna do a little hint of, um, one second. Okay. We're gonna use a little bit of salt. I think that's enough cause I don't like saucy shit at all. Then we're gonna do a little bit of pepper. It's coming out. There we go. A little bit of pepper. Then we're gonna do two tablespoons of the abato seasoning, whatever, however you pronounce it. Like I said, I don't know. Uh, yeah, two tablespoons TSP. Y'all, one day I was making some um, brownies, and this was like when I first started baking by myself. Mama wanted me to do it myself, so I tried to do everything myself and it was like a half cup of a half cup of um I had to I had to add a half cup of vegetable oil in and I put a cup and a half of vegetable oil in and I was just so confused on why it was so watery until I read the measurements. I was so mad because you know when you have your tongue tasted like when you have a taste for something and you don't get it that's the worst that's worse than a breakup. I'm not even gonna lie. So yeah, I was real hurt. But the next day I made sure I read that damn seasoning thing right. So like I said, we're gonna do, I think she cut her stove off. I'm gonna just cut mine off. Two tablespoons of this seasoning. Okay. Is it gonna focus? There we go. Two tablespoons of this. So, it got, it got a lot of holes in here, so make sure you ain't over porn like me. I kind of bought some. This stuff right here smells good. Like you don't even come out of this hole though. Whatever. I'm gonna count that as one. I should have did it like this. Put it in here. Yeah, pour it in here and then pour it in here. And that's like two. I'm gonna just add a little bit more since it's already on here. And then we want one tablespoon of onion powder. Like that. And then we're gonna do one tablespoon of Creole seasoning. And we also got some cream cheese because we think the cream cheese is going to be good in them. What you think? I think that's going to be so good. So I got some cream cheese and I might have to open this with a knife. So, and then I'm not spreading it out enough, so I'm about to start spreading it out some more. So I'll sprinkle it over the whole little thing. I'm about to give it a stir because I feel like it's just marinating. Okay, it's starting to smell good now. Okay. And then we got one tablespoon of paprika. Paprika? No, no, you're going to see that I read them. I'll take some. 
They got all this stuff rigged. I can't open anything. I want to make a Cajun seafood boil on that. I just need to get a debit card or an EBT card on me. So yeah, one tablespoon of paprika. I feel like I'm not even coming out of here. I guess. Okay. Then you sit that to the side. And then we're gonna need the one cup of the tomato. Ooh, this smells so good. We're gonna need one cup of the tomato sauce. So I'm about to go and get that. Oh, uh, do we have a can opener? <laughs> oh my god. I'm gonna have to call around, hold on. Y'all, we don't have a can opener. They gonna get tired of me, mm-hmm. to stab it because this bringing the flavor oh right here see when in doubt look it up on youtube of course i'm gonna give it a taste test y'all want to give it a taste test or y'all just want to wait okay y'all gonna come here and get your hands or y'all want to put on the plate Okay, I'm about to get him a taste test. Let me stir it up. Mind you, we still halfway through. Who first? <laughs> I'm excited. Who next? Mm. It's good? Oh my god. Don't gas me. <laughs> uh, don't gas me. Y'all, taste that, y'all. Oh my god. She lying. No, she not. No, she not. Ooh. You should do a layer with half like that and half with the cream cheese. Okay. Let's see, y'all. Uh, half of the sauce, though. After you the like sauce. it? Yeah, you need to do it. That shit fire. That shit good as fuck. No, I'm a little worried, but last time I cooked the shit. But okay, I'm hey, y'all. I can't wait to eat it now. Okay. Yeah, no, oh, it is good. It is good. Oh, my God. So, I got to find a way how to open this can because we getting the tomato sauce in here. <laughs> He told me to say like a He said break it in half like this. He's showing me how to break it. Who wants to fold the other one? Break it in half? Yeah, that's what he's doing, sure. Oh, and it's coming out though. Is it a medium? Yeah, but I am like, you push it in half like this. I'm about to show you. Oh my God, fucking sauce. So, it is gonna bust. Ugh, you gotta press it in half to get the sauce to come out. But this shit hard after you get Oh, I'm hungry. I just that was a teaser. Yeah, that was fire. But they had a. They probably had oh, a. They stabbed it. But it's sauce. You want to stab it? Oh. busted it open she said one cup of it so i'm gonna measure it i might not need that one i'm gonna take this off the hook because i'm gonna have to wash these anyway i like that it was good really y'all they like it because usually i be sketchy when i be cooking But shit, it must be good if they gas it like that. Okay, hold on. So yeah, we are doing this to get away. I stabbed it with a screwdriver and I'm squeezing now. But I might need to get some more open because 
It's not working. Well, it's working, but I probably cut the can. Oh my god, come out. So I'm just gonna keep doing this and squeezing it until I got a whole cup. Or if I don't have a whole cup, a half a cup would be fine. I'm mad as fuck I don't have a can opener. That was the stupidest shit. like fucking tomato paste though. I was scared the meat was gonna be nasty. Huh? Okay, I can't get the rest of this shit out, so we just gonna use half of a cup. Oh wait, it's coming out like this. work out <laughs> oh my arms <laughs> shit coming out that way this is enough here's our cup pour it in there and then oh shit Okay, then we need one fourth tablespoon of the basil, basil. Yes. Basil, of the basil uh, paste. Okay. So my basil, base, paste, whatever, is, you could either use one fourth or you could use a tablespoon, a half of a tablespoon. I'm gonna do the half of a tablespoon because what if it's real good and it brings the stuff to life, you know? So, I got my half tablespoon. Ooh, this smell good. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> and I'm gonna put half of a tablespoon in there. You wanna smell it? I, I knew you were going to. That's no good. You want to smell it? Uh, you got your nose? Yeah, it's not alright. It's not like ravioli or yeah, something. Yeah, that's what it is. Ravioli. It's like ravioli. That's what it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna live. It's not just like <laughs> so then, after we do that, we're gonna need. I didn't get no cilantro because I couldn't find cilantro. So it's say two tablespoons of brown sugar, and then we're gonna do the two cups of rice. My rice is already cooked, so. Um, what I come over for? Brown sugar. Oh yeah, thanks. Let me make sure she's doing it how good. Inch of beef bouillon. And of course, we're gonna hit it with the saucy sauce. So we're gonna add some Worcestershire right. sauce. Yes, we are. Like why? <laughs> oh, it's still on. We haven't even added everything to the pan at the aroma right now. OMG. Oh, yeah. It smells so good. So you know that if it smells this okay, good, come on. it's gonna taste even better. Am I right or am I right? It's gonna be so <laughs> She's delicious. Done. We're gonna go in with about a cup of your favorite brand of tomato sauce. Yes, you're gonna add that saucy sauce. To take it up a couple notches, we're also gonna add some basil paste. Now, if you don't have basil paste, of course, you can get some fresh basil, chop it one up, 
or you could even use some dry basil. If you don't have it, don't go crazy, just don't add it. We're also gonna add some cilantro paste. Same thing, if you don't have the paste, you can use dried or fresh cilantro. Mix it all up and combine it really good. And at this time, we're gonna add our brown sugar. Now, let me tell you why we're adding the brown sugar. We want to neutralize any acidity from the tomatoes that may be in the saucy sauce, right? So adding the brown sugar is just to balance it out a bit. And of course, it's not gonna make our meat mixture taste sweet by any means. We're gonna go on with about two cups of rice to this one pound of meat. So I'm gonna do two tablespoons of the brown sugar. This is one. And here's two. And I also cut my eye back on because hers looked like it was still cooking. So I just cut my eye back on. And then after this, we're gonna get two cups of the rice and we're gonna pour that in here with this. I'm gonna stir this first, just so everything can get hot again. Cause I cut the eye all the way off. It probably done cooled off and everything. I was hanging it back up real quick. I'm making a mess over here. But also, so we wanted ours with cream cheese. I think I already told y'all that, but I'm gonna tell y'all again because I don't know what's going on. But we want ours with cream cheese. So we're gonna add cream cheese at the, I don't know if I wanna do the bottom of them yet or the top. I think I'm gonna do the top because then that'll be easy to peel it off if I don't like it. But I think that's gonna be good with it. Cause like you can't miss with cream cheese. Oh, is this oven still on? What's that that she's putting on there right now? Is that the cheese? What? No, that's the rice. Oh. So then we're gonna uh, get two cups. I think you said two cups, yep. Two cups of our pre-cooked rice. Yes, I still got the tomato sauce in here, but it's all going in the same bowl. So I'm just gonna scoop my rice in here. Dump it. I'm gonna do a half of a cup. I feel like that's gonna be so much rice. Dump that. Oh, I gotta scoop this out. Okay. And then we're gonna give this a stir. Try to be careful so it don't fly everywhere. This looks so freaking good. And I got the butter on the rice. And this rice also made it thicker too, so all the juice that was at the bottom is soaking in the rice, so. And we're gonna combine it really good. We're not gonna chop it on up, but we're just gonna fold it on in. Make sure the rice is well combined. If you don't have any boiled rice on hand, or if you didn't boil the rice prior to making the meat mixture, you can always add the raw rice to the meat mixture. What? However, if you're adding a cup of rice, be sure to add two cups of liquid, whether it be beef broth or chicken broth, Ugh, who or that? even water. I find it a lot easier to boil the rice while the meat mixture is cooking, because guess what? To boil rice, it takes about 50 minutes. This looks good, y'all want to taste it again or no? On the type of rice that okay. you use. And to make this meat mixture, it takes about 20 to 25 minutes. Okay, so we are gonna taste it with the rice in here. Oh my hot. god, it made it better. Oh my god, mm. I'm gonna eat this. It's hot. With the cheese, oh my god, like, it's the so on free. there. This is gonna be so good. Oh my god. That did make it better though. It did. Oh 
So, okay, ladies, you know what you're doing. Right? And do. <laughs> I'm gonna get one with her recipe. Mm -hmm. Why not, right? Yes, yeah, she does. In time, give it a quick taste if you need to add oh, other did. things, whether it be a oh, no, she black. maybe a little bit more onion black. powder, salt, mm -hmm. brown, black pepper. Do y'all think I need more powder or more anything? Now no, that we're done, we're gonna give it over some right. cheese. Add your favorite brand of cheese, okay. whether it be Mexican, cheddar, Shut Amazon. Up. Shut up. So now we're gonna add our cheese. I love cheese, so I'm gonna overdo it every time. We got Kobe yeah, Jack. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I can eat cheese off the pack. She called me during my vlog. You called me during my vlog. I'm cooking it still. I'm gonna send you a picture when I'm done. Okay. No, I did it all myself. Yeah, I'm making a video right now. Okay, bye. So I'm gonna. Oh, my battery's dying. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna put this much cheese in here. I'm mad as hell. I'm not gonna lie. Mm -hmm. Let me cut this off so I don't delete. So here's the final product. Let me zoom out. And we're gonna taste it. I might have to record on my phone because I don't have no service. But look at that. Y'all look at it in this camera. Ooh. Oh my God. So yeah. We gonna tell y'all how they is. Hold on. She gonna call me back. Watch. Okay, y'all. Oh, I can't even see myself. I don't know. Can't do that. So y'all can go ahead and taste it. I don't even know how to. Oh Wait, I'm about to taste it. I'm about to just scoop it because I don't want the camera to die. I'm gonna scoop it. Mmm, the cream cheese. Oh my god. I'm gonna scoop it from the top. Ooh. What Mr. Hotspot said? Delicioso. <laughs> 10 out of 10. I'm gonna put her video link down below in the description. Ooh. Ooh. So y'all can go get it. You like it? The cream cheese is busting out of here. But let me try to pepper with it. Cause you I like it? Mm -hmm. You do? Oh, oh, my. You like it? <laughs> so everybody like it. I'm in this video before my camera died. Like, comment, subscribe. And I'm going to be back with more videos.